Please, Lord, please, Lord, don't hurt me today. Please, Lord, let this not be so spicy. Oh my gosh. Why is my mouth burning? That didn't work. Oh, hell no. Yo, what is up, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you're new here. My name is Kathleen, and today I am bringing you guys a brand new video. All right, y'all, so in today's video, we are gonna be testing out some TikTok snacks. Y'all already know I've tested out them viral food hacks, them life hacks, all of the hacks that TikTok even has, but I've never made a video just for TikTok snacks, so I figured I'd make a video testing them out to show you guys whether they're actually good and worth all that hype, or if they're complete cap, and usually they are complete cap. But we gonna see, and as you guys can tell, it includes cotton candy. And how can it go wrong with cotton candy, y'all? Like, it just can't. I'm low-key nervous to test some of this out, but let's jump right into it. All right, y'all, so I'm gonna be showing you everything that I'm doing over here. Guys, I even got a little cutting board. Honestly, I should not be making these types of videos because as you can see, I don't handle knives properly, but it's all good. Like, I'm 100% safe. But all right, for this first snack, y'all gonna need a jalapeno. And y'all know these things are hot, like they is spicy. But don't worry, because by removing the seeds, which we're gonna do, takes away the spice. And then you're also gonna need some cream cheese and some Takis. I got the purple bag because that's what they use, but like, I'm sure anything would work. Yo, what the hell is that? Since when do Takis come looking like that, girl? What the hell? Fun fact, I don't like Takis. Or the last time I tried it, I didn't like it. I like hot Cheetos, but these? Mm -mm. But let me try it. No, I don't like them. Yo. All right, y'all. If it looks like I'm crying, I swear I'm not. It's just that Takis dust went down the wrong tube or something and made me choke. You know what I mean? I swear I can handle spice. Like, I really can. <laughs> all right, anyway. So you take your jalapeno, right? And you just cut off its head, okay? That's all you do. You cut it enough to just... Chop off its head, just like that. Is that an eyelash? Oh, hell no. Nah. You see all them seeds? You wanna scoop it out unless you really want to die. Okay, you're not gonna die literally, but like, it'd be hot. I don't know, we're just gonna go with it. Well, that didn't work. I don't wanna put my finger in it because every time I put my finger in it, well then I'm gonna have to wash my hands because the last time I touched a jalapeno and then I forgot to wash my hands, I rubbed my eye. And y'all, no kidding, I could not open my eye for like 10 minutes. I thought I lost my eyesight. True story. All right, you know what? We're just gonna scoop it out with our hands. Somebody teach me all this cooking stuff. I don't use these. All right, y'all, that took me a minute, but look at that, all cleaned out. That's what y'all gotta do. I swear if this is still spicy, somebody gonna get sued, okay? I'm just kidding, but now all you gotta do is literally just fill it. Fill it up with cream cheese. Put it all in there, okay? Pack it up. Maybe I should be using a spoon. You know what? No, no. Yes, there we go. That's what I was looking for. And actually, I don't even think this would be spicy anyways because cream cheese is a dairy so i think it'll help it you know what i mean you know what i mean y'all see that is that a jalapeno no that's a cream cheese jalapeno so now all you gotta do is take some takis she did not just do that and then you just poke it in there all right but honestly like what kind of snack is this like who the heck just had a jalapeno and said mm, let me stuff it with some cream cheese i mean that's kind of like typical like i see that but then adding takis to it like what the heck but it low-key looks cool like it looks kind of nice though don't it i mean it looks kind of weird okay i need to stop talking i am literally stalling because i am so nervous i feel like this is gonna be like extreme heat but like all right all right <sighs> please lord please lord don't hurt me today please lord let this not be so spicy oh my Oh my gosh okay here we go all right wait a minute oh hell no y'all didn't do it i know y'all didn't do it i know y'all didn't do it all right but who made this like who made this beautiful creation that is literally fire what the oh that that was a little bit spicy all right here we go why is my mouth burning Oh my god, my mouth is on fire, dog. All right, y'all, I don't know if you can see my lips that well, but it looks like I just got my lips filled. I don't even know, like, Kim K who? I don't know what happened. Like, that jalapeno just turned around and it said, no, girl, no. You thought you was gonna get rid of me. You thought you wasn't gonna keep up with my heat. No, girl, mm -mm -mm. Honestly, it wasn't spicy at all, but I think I didn't fill it right at the bottom of it, and uh, maybe there was a seed or two, I don't know. But honestly, guys, that was a straight 10 out of 10. It honestly tasted like a taco. Like, I don't know how. It just tasted like a straight taco like it was so good but point is go try it i mean i loved it i don't know it kind of backfired on me with the spice but like honestly it's not spicy if you do it right i just feel like i missed something but it's gonna be a 10 
out of 10 from me. All right, so for this next snack, all you're gonna need is a bell pepper, orange, yellow, green, your pick. I got some orange ones right now. And then again, you're gonna need some cream cheese and some everything bagel seasoning or like sesame seasoning. That's really what it is. All right, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna cut it up, all right? Cut this bell pepper, you know, take off its hat. This thing's its hat, by the way. To me, it's a hat. So we're gonna take off its head decapitate it really Damn! sorry I play too many video games taking it off this way actually you can just cut it by the stem thingy and then twist it and look all the seeds are off just that dang easy that literally took me two seconds to do and now y'all can't say that I haven't taught y'all something and if you already knew to cut it like that then you know what just go with it all right so now we're gonna cut it into three slices, snap it, you know? And now y'all just wanna fill it up with some cream cheese again, all right? So while I do this, let's just have a little chat, me and you, all right? So uh, what y'all been up to? Okay, so I haven't posted in like a week, but now I'm back and I'm back to posting twice a week. I post on Wednesdays and Sundays for those of you that are new here. So if you're not already subscribed and you like what you see and hit that subscribe button down below because like, girl, I see y'all, all right? Majority of y'all watch my content like consistently and y'all ain't subscribed like what what did I do no nah, but seriously like how y'all been like how y'all doing y'all doing good you know COVID and everything it's still not over like and like everything that's happening you know so let me know down in the comments how y'all doing okay but all right my bell pepper is full of cream cheese I think I put too much don't know you know what there is no such thing as too much cream cheese is bomb I just dropped so many seeds all right we just gonna fill it I think I put too much all right let's try this <laughs> You know, I just put so many seeds, but I bit where no seeds were. Like, hold up. Wait a minute. Guys, this is so good. Dude, I'm gonna have to eat this thing, okay? I'll let y'all know how I feel after I'm done. That was so good, and it's honestly a healthier option. I mean, the cream cheese low-key isn't good for you, but you got the bread, aka the bell pepper, and you got the cream cheese. That is so much better, especially for all y'all gluten-free people like me. I don't eat bread like that. But all right, guys, this was a legit 10 out of 10. Like I said, go get some bell peppers, get some cream cheese, get that everything bagel seasoning, y'all. Get it, okay? But all right, guys, let's move on to the last snack all right y'all for this next tiktok snack i don't even know how to feel like this one is actually crazy like i don't know who made this snack i don't know how y'all thought of it but we gonna test it out so all you gonna need is some dill pickles you gonna need some pickles and then you gonna need some cotton candy but yeah all you gotta do is wrap the pickle in cotton candy and i i don't even like if you just think about it like what kind of drugs i mean i'm not saying they were on drugs but like for me to mix something like that, like I need to be on some serious crazy stuff. I'm just saying. All right, so let's open this. So you're supposed to take a pickle and then you have to like dry it. Like it can't be wet at all or else the cotton candy is gonna like dissolve. And then you get some cotton candy. Mmm, look at that cotton candy. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do one pink, one blue, and one a mix of blue and pink. So with that being said, let's just get three ready then. All right, so what you do is you take your cotton candy. Hold on, hold on. We're gonna test if this is even good. Mm, that is good all right it passed the test i don't even know how they wrap it like that like this is what i mean like how y'all just playing around with cotton candy all right we just put it right in the center and we just gonna pat it down it's getting all over my fingers like how does this even work yo it's all falling apart all right now we're gonna dig in for some blue cotton candy take this and wrap it it just can't get past my head like how y'all just be sitting down wrapping a freaking pickle and some cotton candy like what kind of all right, so now for the mixture, we're gonna take some. Y'all, this looks <laughs> like a terrible job. I don't know how y'all do it, and I don't know how y'all make it look all cute and stuff. Like, I don't know what kind of cuteness this is, but like, voila, look at that pink and blue mixture, y'all. <laughs> That's how you do it. Okay, look at my hands, though. Like, you know what? We just gonna try it, okay? Oh! All right, let's try the blue one. Uh-uh. I know y'all don't think this is actually good. Like, this is just not it. It's like a sour pickle, right? And then you mix that with a candy. So it's like sweet and sour. I no, it's just not a good mixture. I like pickles and I like cotton candy, but together, mm-mm, honey. That is just not it, all right? Separate and they just fine. So I'm gonna have to give it like a two out of 10. They just don't go together, no. All right, guys, that's all the TikTok snacks. But saying I'm such a trendsetter, I'm gonna 
try my own creation of a snack, all right? And if I see anybody taking this as a credit on TikTok because it's so fire, I'm coming for y'all. So what you do is you take a piece of a banana and you eat it. Mmm, wow. I'm just kidding y'all, but I am gonna try something crazy because I just wanna know like how y'all come up with these creations. Like, do you guys just have cotton candy chilling and then you take whatever else you can find and you mix it? If that's the case, we gonna try some banana and cotton candy. I'm sure somebody already did this, but you know what? I'm gonna pretend like y'all haven't done it because this is crazy, okay? So you just take some cotton candy and your banana. That actually wasn't bad. Let me try another piece. I might be tripping. Yo. I might be onto something. What the hell? I kid you not. Cotton candy and banana is the next move, okay? But no, seriously, guys, forget the pickle. Grab a banana, stuff it with some cotton candy. I swear it is so good. Like, this is a 10 out of 10. That pickle, 2 out of 10. But all right, guys, that is all the snacks that I'm going to be trying for today's video. And honestly, they went in order from, like, best to worst. My favorite snack was definitely the jalapeno with cream cheese and Takis. It tasted like a taco. Like, no lie, it tasted 100% like a taco. But then you had the pickles and cotton candy, which was also all over TikTok. And that one was a complete fail, y'all. That was a 2 out of 10, and that's me being generous, like, seriously. It was not good. Like, they do not mix well. It just tasted like candy and pickle, and I... No. But other than that, guys, that is going to be a wrap for today's video. If you did enjoy today's video, be sure to smash that like button. Leave me a comment down below which one you're going to be trying. Or if you have any video suggestions you want to see me do, let me know. And if you're not already subscribed, be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications because I post on Wednesdays and Sundays. And without further ado, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you all in my next video. Peace. Yeah. No, no, no.